Korea's rival political parties are wrangling over whether to go ahead with the prime minister-designate Moon Chang-guk's confirmation hearings amid the increasingly heated debate over his controversial views and comments on history. Chi Myung Gil has more. A motion calling for parliamentary confirmation of the new prime minister nominee Moon Chang-guk will be submitted to the National Assembly on Tuesday. Once the request is filed, legislators have 20 days to vote on the appointment. The ruling Saenuri party has jumped to Moon's defense, saying he needs to be given a chance to be vetted through a confirmation hearing. Party spokesperson Park Tae-chul accused the main opposition New Politics Alliance for Democracy, or NPAD, of not giving Moon a chance. The main opposition bloc is not even giving the nominee a chance to be questioned on stage. Not holding a confirmation hearing is anti-democratic and goes against the people's will. The ruling party has attacked the opposition bloc, accusing it of using the controversy surrounding Moon to score political points. However, the MPAD, which has been concentrating fire on Moon's questionable comments regarding historical issues, continues to demand his withdrawal. If Moon stays on, it will be an insult to the people, turn Korea into a pathetic nation, cast doubt on President Park's concept of a nation and bring ridicule to the Senri party. In a lecture delivered at his church a few years ago, Moon said Japan's colonization of Korea and the division of the Korean Peninsula was all part of God's will. The National Assembly will hold a three-day interpolation session starting Wednesday, signaling the start of June's extraordinary session. Jim Young-gil, Arirang News.